viewers over the world good morning a simple topic today my situation your situation is redeemable glory be to god let's go back to what happened the god we are talking about i'm reading genesis chapter 2 from verse 7 and the lord god formed the man of the dust of the ground and he breathed into his nostrils the breath of life and the man became a living being to god be the glory once upon a time God collected and touched your dust. And he breathed his precious breath of life. And you became what you are. He made it what you are from the dust. That is the God we are talking about. Whatever he does, I want you to now know his ability. If he got you from the dust, and he loved what he made, for his glory. And he made it what you are. That that what you are can breathe. It can walk. It can walk. It can think. It can grow. Oh, why do you forget who God is? What is your situation? Is it a dust-like situation? God is more than able. Because in the beginning you were dust. But why were you created? Listen to this. I'm reading Genesis chapter 1, verse 26. Then God said, let us make man in our image according to our likeness. Let them have dominion over the fish of the sea, over the birds of the air, and over the cattle, over all the earth, and over every creeping thing that creeps on the earth. So God created man. In his own image, in the image of God, he created him. Male and female, he created them. To God be the glory. The main purpose of our creation, we were brought here as managers, male or female, to manage God's estate. Let us create man, meaning manager, who will manage all whatever we have created. But the question, how are you managing his estate? At the last day, the account will be required. How did you manage my estate? When I sent you as a manager, watch. Because you shall be and you'll be answerable to what you came to manage. And you came to manage for the glory of God. He had and he still has a very big plan for you. Before your being, you had no plan for your being. He designed a plan of your coming and your being. Now, turn to God who 
had a plan of your coming. Your being. And he has a plan of you after the earth. So why do you trouble your mind so much? You who had no plan of your being. Plan of your coming. Let us trust him. God who has our plan. What is your problem? But remember, as you are managing, are you managing for God's glory? That is what Jesus said. And whatsoever you ask in my name, I will do it that the Father may be given glory. The coming of our Lord Jesus and whatever I did on the earth, it was for God's glory. What are you doing? Is it for God's glory? If not for God's glory, eh, eh, this is a trouble. Listen to this. John 14, 13. And whatever you ask in my name, that I would do, that the Father may be glorified in the son. Now, which a monasabanga Molinia Yange, a Chonachi Colanga, Chitange Agumis Wenga Momoana. He never said that I'll do everything you ask. Tea Gamba and Tinja Colla and Nabi Nabi Musaba. No, no, no. And whatsoever, Nabulichona, quote me right, and whatsoever, Nabulichona, can bring glory to God, my father. Katonda Chitangi. I will do that. Now begin to ask. Oh, whatever things. And whatever. Will bring glory to God the Father. That one, Jesus will do it. To God be the glory. What is your situation? Your situation is redeemable. Because he gathered your dust and he made it what you want now. He breathed his precious life, the breath of life, and you became a living being. What about this situation now? Your dust like situation, God can still. Breathe upon it the breath of blessing to God be the glory. God the Father. Your dust like situation. Uh, God the Father who has a plan for you for his glory can he still breathe Upon you in that situation, a breath, a breath of prosperity. And you begin to prosper. Is it a business? May the Father breathe upon you and your business the breath of life, the breath of prosperity. <laughs> Receive the breath of prosperity. I receive. Receive the breath of prosperity. I receive. So that your business, or a business yo, will begin to walk. E so will begin to walk. E will begin to move. E will begin to see. E Profits. E will begin to breathe. E Say, Oh Lord Jesus. Kamat, I am wange yes. Here is my dust like situation. I am jobless. But once upon time, you gathered my dust and breathed upon it your precious breath of life. And this is what you made. This me. Chino, 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 nze, this is nze, what nze. you made. Nze, che, che, Father che, che, in che, Christ nze. Jesus. Christo, Yesu. Breathe upon me. Nze, si, Do it again. Nze, Another breath. Omuko, of prosperity. Omuko, kula, kula, that my business. Or a business yang. 
may become a living business. Hallelujah. My situation, which is jobless, may become a job situation, a working situation, that I turn this way or the other way. I have business this way. I have business the other way. Because of the breath of life, you have breathed on me. Lord Jesus, this is my marriage. It's redeemable. Because from the dust, you made it what I am. Now you can do it. My dust like situation. You can turn this and do that. Hey, hey. To go be the glory. Why should you worry? God the Father has sent his son Christ Jesus to turn your situation, which is a dust like. Eh? Eh? To go be the glory into a living situation that you may walk, you may work, you may be happy. Ask him to breathe upon you the breath of joy, the breath of prosperity, the breath of happiness, the breath of ability. Listen to this. I'm reading 128 Genesis. Then God blessed them, and God said to them, Be fruitful and multiply, fill the earth and subdue it, have dominion over the fish of the sea, over the birds of the air, and over every living thing that moves on the earth. To God be the glory. Father in heaven, we are talking about. He lifts the poor from the dust. The book of Samuel chapter 2, verse 8. He raises the poor from the dust and lifts the beggar from the earth heap and set them among princes and make them inherit the throne of glory. For the pillars of the earth are the Lord's. And he has set the world upon them. His character, God the Father. His habit, God the Father. He is so loving. And whatever he does, he does it right from the dust. He is the one who knows how to mold from the dust and make it what you are. To God be the glory. What is your situation? When he sent his son across Jesus, he showed us that he's like the father. I'm reading John 9. They were asking many questions. He said, why should you ask all these questions? I'm here to show you the likeness of my father. They asked him a question. Lord, who sinned? This one, no? Oh, his parents. Listen to this. God the Father. He molded us from the dust. And he breathed upon us the breath of life. We became what we are. He can do that again. Say, oh Lord, that you did to me, to my dust, do it again. 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 In Jesus' holy name. I'm reading John 9, verse 1. Now as Jesus passed by, he saw a man who was blind from birth. And his disciples asked him, saying, Rabbi, who sinned, this man or his parents, that he was born blind? Jesus answered, neither this man nor his parents sinned, but that the works of God should be revealed in him. Oh. To God be the glory. I must work the works of him who sent me. Well, it is the, the night is coming when no one can work. As long as I'm the world, I'm the light of the world. 
When he had said these things, he spat on the ground and made clay with the saliva, and he anointed the eyes of the blind man with the clay. And he said to him, Go wash in the pool of Siloam, which is translated saint. So he went and washed, and he came back seeing. Therefore the neighbors and those who previously had seen that he was blind said, Is it not he who sat and begged? Some said, This is he. Others said, He is like him. He said, I'm he. Therefore they said to him, How were your eyes open? He answered and said, A man called Jesus medically and anointed my eyes and said to me, Go to the pool of Siloam and wash. So I went and washed, and I received my sight. <laughs> to God be the glory. He has sent his son Christ Jesus ah, to, me, Christo, yes. to do it again. They ask him many questions. Why should you ask yourself many questions? He has sent his son ah, to, me, to breathe upon you the breath of life. That whatever you do may begin to walk. May begin to walk. Receive the breath of life. I receive. 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 In your body. I receive. In your soul. I receive. In your business. I receive. In your present. I receive. In your future. I receive. In your building. I receive. In your business. I receive. Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Breathe upon me. Breathe upon me. The breath of life. The breath of life. Jesus, Jesus, prayer. Saba, 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 Breathe saba. upon me, O oh Lord, the saba breath of muka. life, ah, that I may walk again, that I may walk again. I haven't been walking. Breathe upon me, O oh Lord, the breath of life, that I may walk again, that I may see the businesses. Prayer. Ah, Breathe upon me, O oh Lord, the breath of life. Breathe upon me, the breath of life, prayer. 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 Prayer, prayer. Musabe, musabe, musabe. In Jesus' holy name, to God be the glory. Are you sick? Receive the breath of life. I receive. What is that sickness? Hmm. From the dust. He made it what you are. Receive the breath of life. Be healed in Jesus' name. 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 Are you blessed? May he breathe upon you the breath of blessings. Receive blessings in Jesus' name. I receive. Receive blessings in Jesus' name. I receive. Receive the blessings I receive. in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. To go be the glory. Guess what? Teba. Let's see what the Lord has done to our brother. Eh? To go be the glory. Let's see, brother Amuku from Kenya. That is what the Bible says. If any man step into Christ Jesus, he is a new creation. All the things have gone away. 
receive the breath of life. Be healed in Jesus' name. Your situation be here. Your back be here. Your stomach be here. Your chest be healed. Your breast be healed. Your heart be healed. What is your condition? Receive healing. In Jesus' holy name.